welcome back my beautiful souls <laughs> i honestly in the beginning i was actually kind of like iffy about doing this video because i was like but then i was like girl fuck it fuck it fuck society fuck everything and i said all right well i'm gonna do it whatever whatever and like i just shut my overthinking away and i was like you know what i'm gonna do it right now and i did it and i did my makeup and i was like okay i'm gonna do it no a lot of people ain't really prepared for this, honestly. Motherfuckers are gonna be like, bro, you nasty. And you know what I'm gonna say? I'm gonna say, you know what? I don't give a fuck because I'm doing what I like and I'm speaking out for what I believe in. We have no apologies for being from you where the wild My lipstick too bougie to be fucking it up every time I drink water. Anyways. I'm doing this for the girls who are too scared or too afraid to do what they want to do because they're afraid of criticism. You guys need to learn and know that it doesn't matter what the fuck people got to say. Just as long as you enjoy what you're doing with your body, that's all that fucking matters, okay? Do you feel comfortable shaving every fucking day just so you, just so you can do this and nobody will tell you shit? <laughs> or are you doing it because you simply don't care and you just want to do it because you like it? Because me, I shave because I enjoy it. You know, like, you know, it feels like I'm like playing like the, the violin or some shit. But there's some girls who hate that shit, who hate shaving, but do it because they have to impress people. Because they feel the need that they have to follow what society has to say about placing us in a little box. And this is how girls are supposed to be. And you, you're supposed to like the color pink and you're supposed to shave and you're supposed to do your hair like this. And you're not supposed to do this or that. Fuck y'all. Fuck society. What the fuck is girly like? Who the fuck told us that girls aren't supposed to shave? Like, what? Like, who even said that? If we were really here to be fucking shaved rats, we would have never even had hair on our bodies since the beginning. You know what I mean? Like, we just choose what we want to do with our bodies, and that's just how it is. I was sitting one day. I've actually been wanting to do this, only because I realized that people give a fuck a lot. A lot of people give a fuck what people gotta say about them. And you know what? I wanna break this boundary. Like, even though I like shaving, I wanna try it. I wanna try it out. I wanna see what's up. You don't have to conform to anything that society wants you to be, okay? You could be literally anything and everything you want to be. If you wanna be a fucking koala, go and hang yourself on a fucking tree and call yourself a fucking koala. And don't listen to society, alright? People are gonna say, bitch, you is crazy. Boy, you is crazy, okay? But I'm happy. The fuck, the fuck y'all gonna do to me, huh? Huh? I'll be hanging on this tree, minding my fucking business, and fuck whoever says that it's wrong. <clears throat> and the thing that bothers me is like, <clears throat> even girls bash on girls for wanting to be who they are. And they're the first ones to judge girls who like have body hair when y'all over there pretending like y'all don't sit there on the fucking weekends that y'all don't go out and have fucking hairy ass legs and hairy ass panene. Like y'all, the first ones who judge are the first ones who do that shit and like are too embarrassed to fucking say it. So like, why don't, if we see a girl with hairy ass legs and hairy ass armpits, we just like, girl, I see you embracing your shit. I see you, girl. Keep that girl. Keep growing, girl. Keep growing. There is nothing wrong with that. And we sit here and we think it's gross. Why? Why do we think it's gross? It's annoying, you know? Like, come on, y'all. Get with the shits. Like, if you forgot to shave and you want to wear a dress, like, wear that shit you know what i mean like only if you can feel comfortable but i just feel like people don't feel comfortable because of the fact that they're they all they know that motherfucker is gonna be talking shit and not only girls too because guys get body shamed for fucking wanting to shave their legs and their armpits like why do we do this like why is it is it wrong like if they want to shave their fucking arms and their fucking legs and everything it doesn't matter let them do whatever they want to do damn i'm waiting for the day that i see somebody with like some girl with like hairy legs and the hairy um hairy armpits and shit and i'm like girl i love you because you're embracing the fuck out of it and you know what you walked out in public and that is balls bro honestly i'm proud of myself i'm i I really am because you know what I'm about to do this I'm about to do it and I'm gonna show you all right now hey motherfuckers I am back and well I'm about to show y'all I'm really excited to see to do this because it's like bro y'all ready I'm about to, I'm about to just show y'all what well, it's time to embrace our soul woman yep 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 
that yep i've been growing i've been growing my hairs what <coughs> look y'all see this my cute little fucking squirrel the thing is like i'm embracing myself how i you know prefer in the natural way and my boyfriend's always like oh let me touch this one and let me touch this one and i'm like oh i guess and like he's so cool about it you know what i mean like he doesn't care he's like i'm so glad that you're embracing it and i'm so glad that he's like that because he just doesn't give a fuck he just he's so like he's always talking about i'm so proud of you for you know being different or trying to be different and stuff and it's so cool because like thank you babe and if you don't want to wear a bra and just embrace it embrace it dude and if you want to wear a push-up bra because you know what like people probably think like oh she's fake because she's wearing a push-up bra and like one day her boobs look big and then the other okay let me my boobs are at, at a good size where if i want to make them look big they can look big but if i want them to look natural they look natural and they look small because they're small but they're just cute you know like they're a decent size i like babies anyways but yeah and the thing is dude you literally can be anything and anything that you want to be and dress how you want to be and express who you want to be and show off your body if that's what makes you happy and just 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 do what makes you happy don't listen to people don't listen to society if you want to dye your hair blue and if you want to have hairy legs and if you want to have no eyebrows and if you want to literally just just dye your whole body blue it doesn't matter like dude me growing out my hair doesn't make me less of a girl like or a woman or a lady it doesn't make me less of anything i'm a fucking human with a vagina and i'm i'm a fucking lady because i want to be and i want to have hairy armpits okay i'm probably gonna keep these for like probably like another week because I personally don't like it, but I wanted to do this because I just wanted to inspire you guys to at least try it or inspire the people who are too afraid to do it. The thing is, like, you know what? I'm tired. I'm tired of um being normal. Like, whatever. I want to have a hairy armpit and a shaved one. I mean, constantly, I would, I remember, I would legit shave every day because I just felt like it was nasty for girls to have hairy armpits or to have hairy legs and like i remember i would even get like rashes but because i was like on that constant mindset like oh my god i need to be a girl i need to be a, be a girl i need to be a girl and i need to like fit society's like you know ideal of how girls should be and how a girl should carry themselves and you know what like this year i was like you know what? i want to try everything that i always felt afraid of doing you know like talking about my spiritual experience is something that i never thought that i would be doing and then, you know what like this year i was like i want to have ha a hairy armpit for once you know because i like i said i don't li like it but i wanted to try it out like i'm open to trying new things because i'm literally like down to try everything you know and i don't know i just feel great and i just feel like you know i'm getting to know another part of my body that i haven't been able to do so because i was always worried about what people would think and now it's like I just feel good you know and like just look at it it looks so cute like my little squirrel on the side you know i have a little pet and shit i don't gotta feel alone anymore but if you don't want to shave and if you want to shave this is for you know just to encourage you to do what you want to do with what you with your body and not listen to what people have to say like step out of your comfort zone and like this is actually like stepping out of my comfort zone but i'm actually really enjoying it you know what i mean like it's weird so do what works for your body do what makes you happy. Do what makes you feel more comfortable. Just embrace it, you know? Embrace what makes you feel comfortable. Embrace what you like. And and don't take it to the head when people, like, judge you. Obviously, we're human. Obviously, it's going to hurt when people give us, like, their nasty-ass opinions. But you have to realize that people are going to hate you no matter what the fuck you do. People are going to talk shit no matter what the fuck you do. So might as well do what you like. Let them talk. You know what I mean? Like surround yourself around people who like who want to see you embrace who you are. You know what I mean? Like if there's people in your life who are telling you like you can't oh my god, you can't be a certain way, you know. And and I know what it's like to have like toxic parents who tell you like or like people you actually can't get rid of because your blood tell you like stuff just just ignore it because i know those people you can't get rid of but the only thing you can do is just 
have that mindset that it is you and you need to love yourself and you put yourself in front of everybody when it's necessary like honestly i'm gonna be honest with you guys because you know fuck it um i was kind of iffy about doing this because you know what being humans you actually double think about a lot of things that you do it's a natural thing to do that you know and especially when you're stepping out of a box that people have always been stuck in you know what i mean but like i always have to give myself that pep talk always remember that it's better for it to hurt you than to stop being who you are it's better to be i i somebody said this i don't know who said it but it's like it's better to be hated for what you are than be loved than for what you're not and it's true like just be who you are just be who you want to be my ladies my baby girls my boo-boos and the guys too if you guys want to shave if you guys want to have blue hair just everything just embrace it embrace it and fuck what people think okay thank you guys so much for watching and stay true to your fucking self remain lit and i hope you guys have a beautiful fucking day and don't be afraid to be yourself don't be afraid to glow to outshine motherfuckers who think that they can tell you what to do okay vibrate higher thank you guys for watching I never ask you guys to like videos, to comment, to subscribe, but if you guys ever do, like, I really appreciate it. So, thank you. No apologies for